language instruction has special needs uh, with regard to online support of courses. We needed to be able to stream audio and video. We needed to be able to constantly experiment and the college m all made all this possible. And uh, we've been able to really, uh, in many ways, to be at, at the cutting edge of most of what the pedagogical experimentation in technology is at Marist College at the moment. We've, I think, We've been the first to stream things. We've been the first to do that voice recording thing. In many ways, um, when the college needed now to have a very exciting model of an online iPod supported project for all our students abroad, they came to us, more specifically to Dr. Gogler, who has really been doing this in his class. And in the end, Dr. Gogler is really driving right now a college-wide institutional effort to create a new model with a study abroad, which I think is original enough that I believe um, uh, Mac, I mean Apple, has paid attention to because uh, we have sort of reversed the function, the use of the iPod. Instead of uh, us delivering information to them and they listen to it, they generate it and upload it to us with their iPods in the field, which is a whole lot of fun. And of course, the children love it, because I mean the children, the students love it because um, they, they do something that they organically know how to do already. I think it's awesome. Once I heard about this program, I jumped on it. I was maybe one of the first people to sign up. I talked to the professor. I couldn't be happier. How do I describe this program? That is a good question. I say I'm talking with a professor from Guatemala. Sometimes I refer to him as Guatemala man. And I, I say, I'm speaking with a headset and a webcam over the internet, and people can't believe that I'm actually talking to someone in another country and that we actually have that course at Marist and they'd never heard it. And they actually wish that they had it for French and other classes, other languages too. Hearing a natural person speak is a huge exposure, and it, it develops your skill not only in the classroom, but also, when you go to the foreign country, you'll be able to utilize their methods of speaking in their native country. You know, you, you still get to use videos in the classrooms. I'm in um, Professor Bayer's course right now. It's called Drug Trade in Asia. And it's, I mean, it's, it's great because it's really relevant to today as well. Um, it touches on Afghanistan and um, at the rest of Asia, but it's it's stuff that you need to know about. But you know, she shows films in her courses and we have internet sources that are great to, to refer back to when you're in the class so then you know you know what you're talking about and it's right there. So it's it's relevant. It's there.